Hello, my name is BJ Cates and thank you for watching. This training video is designed to show how to include various Autodesk product updates with a deployment. The processes in this video assume that the systems you are installing to meet the prerequisites for the products you are installing, that you have created standard out-of-the-box Autodesk deployments that you would like to include updates with. There are two methods for including updates with Autodesk deployments. Add updates from within the Application Manager that appears at the end of a deployment creation. Add updates in the Additional Software section of the deployment configuration. I have just finished creating a deployment for Autodesk Civil 3D 2019 and would like to include all available updates so that they install silently. On the bottom right hand corner of the window is a button, Add Updates. Click this button and the Application Manager will open. With the Application Manager open, I click Update Software. Here we have a list of all available updates for my deployment. Now I'm going to select all the updates by checking the boxes to the left of each update. I am not going to select updates that have been included with newer updates. Updates will not show if you do not have an adequate connection to the Internet. Also, some updates might not show if the serial number you are using to configure the deployment is not associated with an active Autodesk subscription or maintenance plan. When I am finished selecting all the updates I want to include with the deployment, I click the Add Selected button. The updates will now download. Some updates may automatically add or remove themselves if you add an update that includes or requires other updates listed. Some of these updates will not install silently using the Application Manager. However, I can still use the Application Manager to download the updates. I already know that the updates to the base products, such as AutoCAD, Civil 3D, and Mat 3D, will not install silently, so I am going to remove them using the Remove button. I also know that the installer for the Geotechnical Module 2019 is an EXE installer and will not install silently, so I will remove that module as well. I will now close out of the Application Manager. I have now finished including all the updates that will install silently using the Application Manager method. Now, let's look at how to include the base product updates and the geotechnical module to the additional software section of the deployment. I've double clicked the Create and Modify a Deployment shortcut within the Tools folder of my deployment and have clicked the Next button several times to get to the list of applications included with my deployment. Now I'm going to click the pull down menu to expand the additional software section. Next, I am going to click the Add button. I am going to browse my deployment and open the IMG folder. In that folder, I am going to open the Updates folder. In this folder should be a set of folders named with a long string of alphanumeric characters. In each of these folders are the updates you previously downloaded using the Application Manager. Opening each of these folders, I'm going to search for the four updates I want to include in this section. With the update highlighted, I will click OK to add. In the command line parameters, I will add a forward slash Q to install the update silently. I will repeat the process to add the other three updates. With all four updates added in the additional software section, I will minimize the section by clicking on the pull down arrow on the left. Notice that until I do so, the Create button will not be available. Next, I will click Create, and lastly, I will exit out of the window when the configuration has completed. My deployment for Civil 3D 2019 is now complete, and between the Application Manager and the Additional Software section, all my available updates will install silently. For other Autodesk troubleshooting and training videos, please refer to the notes section of this video or search our channel for other content.